Welcome back to Hollow Point Defense. One of the questions I got on another post is what accessories I have on my FPC. So let's start with here. This is my muzzle device. It is out of CAC Industries. It is just a flash can. It's a slim flash can. It was $35. Next, we will move to the Magpul flip-up sights. But if you notice in the middle of it, I took that front post out and I have the Blitz, Blitzkrieg components Chevron. Uh, they're like 27 bucks uh, approximately. But I run these on all my rifles. My ARs have them. Um, uh, even my red dots have this uh, Chevron on it. But that's another story. So the Magpuls I got over here at American Fidelis in Buckeye, Arizona. I forgot what they were, about 50, 60 bucks for the pair. And then the um, Blitz Creek components front post there, the Chevron in the orange or red. And I got that one for 27 bucks, like I said. Then I put on the Streamlight ProTac rail mount light. I want to say that thing was about 115 bucks. Got this off of Amazon. I couldn't touch it. To, couldn't touch the prices anywhere else. Uh, you can also get these at Primary Arms as well. But I think I got this one off of Amazon. And another one I got from Primary Arms when they had a sale back last year in December or November. And then I run a Strike Fire, the Vortex Strike Fire 2. Like this thing right here. It's pretty easy. It's about 188, 190 bucks. Uh, I do like Vortex because if anything goes wrong with it, I can send it to them. They fix it free of charge. If I lose these turret caps, they'll send them to me for free. It, they're fairly simple. It's a very easy optic to run. And then if you notice on this side, I put on the quick disconnect uh, mount for my sling. That was Amazon, two of them for 10 bucks. So that's basically all I have in here. I did change the buffer plug in it. That's a whole new video I uploaded today, but that's all I'm gonna do to it. I'm not changing the buttstock. There's no reason for me to spend a hundred plus dollars on another buttstock that's gonna do the same thing as this one for the same amount of money. Um, do I need to spend 115 on this? No, it's not gonna change the performance for me. Because if I'm going to buy something and put it on here, whether it's to use the sights or the light or the flash can, has to have some kind of advantage for me to spend money on it. But that's it for my M&P right there. So I'll go over it real quick, real quick. I put a light, the flash can, flip up sights, the red dot optic, and I changed the buffer plug back here. That was it. Take care and have a good one.